come back. Just getting the builder's bar out of my teeth. The break song is called Arpy. <laughs> no joke. Arpy.mp3. Have you tried grenade bars? Best protein bar I've ever eaten. I did see another streamer got sponsored by Grenade today. That was the first time I had ever heard of a grenade bar. The second time was just now. This is r slash hail corporate. <laughs> They're astroturfing everywhere, man. I think Canada has a... I don't know if it's like different legislation about this kind of stuff. But I think, you know, we get a much lower variety of uh, of everything, basically. When I was in the U.S. for PAX, I was like, dude, there's like literally 60 protein bars. At the corner store. It was incredible. I had something that was like Dr. Robert Tom's Fit Crunch Bar. And I was like... Probably just a chocolate bar. Then I ate it, and I was like, well, this shit is delicious. A little light on the protein count, 16 grams per bar. But, you know, we were using it for convention fuel. That's not that bad. Robert Irvin? Was it Robert Goulet? Yo, we carry those at Costco. Honestly, it's pretty good. Fit Crunch Bar. Chef Robert Irvin's Fit Crunch for snacking. Yeah, dude, it's 16 grams of protein and 190 calories, which is, those macros are pretty good for a, for a protein bar. You know, three grams of sugar. Like, a Vega bar is 300 calories. It has 20 grams of protein. So it's 110 extra calories, 4 grams of protein. And it's like, I don't know, 15 or 16 grams of sugar. So I don't know what they're doing with this Fit Crunch. Probably a lot of sugar alcohols, but... I'm telling you, it's a, it's a good bar. I don't know if they have it in Canada. We still, I've, been, I've been on the Builders bars, the Vega bars. Your location. Canada. Nope. <laughs> Just eat 100 grams of moose meat. Look, I'm looking for something uh, that I can eat, you know, while streaming easily. Quick boost of energy uh, with some protein as well. I'm not going to buy a bunch of elk sausage. Grass-fed llama like joe rogan and eating in the middle of the podcast okay that's just it's too far let me boot up civ 6 i'm like did i download civ 6 i set this all up last night but i i love my contact at 2k sincerely but the instructions to play this i had to download uh like this, I had to download something that was a JPEG and then change the extension to not be a JPEG, but instead be a, a Microsoft uh, installer, like a .msi file. Then I double clicked on it and I had to enter an authentication code and then it was like, you're good. And then it just came out today. And I'm like, why did I go through all that? I thought I was getting like uh, an early little preview for myself, which is why I jumped through all these hoops and then... 2K was like, oh yeah, it's out today. Come on. So I, I only want to play today if I can play against bots. Let's see if I can make this happen. This is the Civ 6 Battle Royale. You can't? I don't know, dude. The PC Gamer article said they've played against AI. Are you PC Gamer? 
or are you just a dude in Twitch chat? Because I, I can tell you from my perspective right now what it looks like. Yeah, get got. Exactly. Can I ask you, while we're loading it up here... Sorry, let's let's do this one. Um, while we're loading this up here... Uh, how do anime fans feel about that new KFC, uh, it's so loud, dating simulator? Because I think you should say silence brand. Colonel Sanders fucking killed the Human dude. Advanced Did you know that? Knows no boundary. I only found that out like a, a month ago. But this has not been without its price. Colonel Sanders fucking killed the guy. But now they're making... Uh, They're making an anime dating sim. And people are like, mm, Colonel Sanders, so kawaii. And I'm like, nah, dude. That's a silence brand situation. Maybe he didn't kill a guy, but he beat him up. <laughs> One of the two. I shouldn't go around saying Colonel Sanders killed a man. I read a story that said some, some dude had a fried chicken like restaurant uh close to his and he was like move and they were like no uh and then he he beat the crap out of them something like that hey fine jamie pull up the article please about colonel sanders killing that dude it was not from a boomer email chain okay you can't see this yet but Welcome to the end of the world. Red Death is a free-for-all battle to the last faction in the twilight of civilization on a dying planet. The goal is to be the last surviving faction on board the last dropship off the United Planet. The Red Death is a growing storm of radioactivity. Oh, dude, thank you for this article. No, Colonel Sanders never killed a man in a shootout. Okay, I, um, I rebuke and dis dis disavow my earlier statement. The Red Death is a growing storm of radioactivity. Over time, it shrinks and engulfs the world. The safe areas affected by the Red Death are indicated on the map. Units in the Red Death take damage every turn. Same with the water. Find new units and gain experience by exploring the ruined cities, clearing raider outposts, supply acquiring supply drops. These are the only ways you can get new units, so consider your attacks carefully. Play Red Death Battle Royale. Error joining multiplayer session. Error joining multiplayer session. Okay, so hold on. We're gonna play. We're gonna play a multiplayer game on the local network, and I'm going to create one. And uh, the rule set is going to be Red Death. Now, game speed online. Sure, sure, sure. No teams, yeah, yeah. No duplicate civilizations, sure, whatever. It's all good. Confirm settings. Computer, yeah. AI. Why does Cam always desync? It's because it's so powerful, dude. The camera is so powerful, it desyncs the game. Yo, okay, here's our choices, all right, for faction leader. I'll show you the game in just a second. Border Lords, Cultists, Doomsday Preppers, Jocks, Mad Scientists, Mutants, Pirates, Wanderers. I mean, I gotta be a Border Lord. Just kidding. Doomsday Prepper, all the way. All right, so it's starting in 10 seconds here. I'm hoping it's gonna work. I'm hoping we're gonna have AI in the game. And really, this is like, I don't doubt the team at Firaxis. But, like, I have no idea what we're in for here. Where, where's Sean Bean? 
Our leaders have failed us. The Red Death comes for us all. Our old civilization could not stand the test of time. Our only hope lies in the colony ship waiting in orbit for the last survivors of this world. We can remotely pilot the lander, but the other factions are jamming our signal. The only way we will survive is for us to eliminate the other factions. Oh, yeah. No, Carl Urban? It's easier. I don't know what Carl Urban's natural accent is. Um, but I'll tell you, his accent in The Boys is just the most British Cockney accent of all time, but in a deep voice. And then telling people they've lost their balls. Okay, what is happening? Preppers. I gotta... What the heck is this? Okay, if you you lose if your civilians all die, okay? Also, I gotta change my game name to Civilization 6. That's Civilization 4. Love you. Okay, here we go. Um, infantry. We don't know where we are on the map. Why don't we just spread out a little bit? I think in this game, we might want to keep our units close together. Yo, you should be in a convoy with these guys. There you go. What are your abilities? I have no idea. <laughs> Oh, we found something. Yo, what the heck is this? Do we win? It's a loot chest? You're doing great, sweetie. Keep it up. Your unit has earned experience. Promotion available. That's a that's a next turn situation. Ah! Hey, get out of here. Who the heck is that? Hey, we got boys uh, over the ridge. Oh, absolutely destroyed. Where are you going to go? What are you going to do? Oh, you Okay, so the AI is Thankfully, very bad, which I very much appreciate. Oh, you can't move and shoot in the same turn. I'm sorry. So all they've got is their civilian. Excuse me? Clearly, I've forgotten some rules of the game of civilization. There is a loot drop there. I didn't select the military unit body him. Thank you, thank you. Um, excuse me. Maybe you haven't heard, but you're dead, so be dead. What the heck is this? It's just a dude. Hold on. You take your promotion right now. I have no idea. Yeah, yeah, ignore movement penalties. And you know what? You take your promotion, too. I want the loot. Just give me the basic combat strength. Whatever, dude. The barbarians killed them. <laughs> Works for me, brother. Whoa, hold on. Safe zone established. A safe zone in the eye of the storm has been marked on the map. Okay, so we're in the safe zone. Send them. Destroy them. Easy. Promotion available. Civilian raiders? 
They got they got changed. What do we get? Your unit has earned experience. Don't need it. So you're asking about abilities. Our civilian has no abilities. Dude, I don't know. I think we're looted. I think we're fully kitted. We even have two civilians now, I think. What are you going to do? I will say... I would like to... Stop attacking and move towards what I believe is probably the center of the circle, but... You know? Oh, that number is the XP level. Even better. Yeah, there's a circle. You want some too? <laughs> it's very strange. Yo. You have found a city that might contain loot? A supply drop has appeared. This is a 10 kill game. Oh, easily. <laughs> Can you do anything? You can't attack, okay. Please get him. Yo! Now that's a move. All right. Did I? Surely I was gonna, I've just eliminated another faction, right? One additional attack per turn if movement allows. Easy. Preppers reign supreme. <laughs> Whoa, okay, we got another team over there. You got a big problem though, brother. I'm fully kitted. Hold on. Second compound, please. We got a whole squad going now. I don't care about the barbarians now. Irrelevant. Sorry, one unit has a promotion as well. It's my bad. That's the other half of the last team. Fair enough. So we have to find... Yo, a team got eliminated. That's what that sound was, I think. We have to find... The... Oh, no, it's the sound of the circle. We need to find the... Uh, dropship? To get the heck out of town? Yeah, please stop calling it a circle when it's clearly a hex. As is fitting. We can enter the water, but if we enter the water, we take damage every turn. So I'm kind of trying to stay away and just hope that it's on a different... It's not on a different island, I should say. Yo, barbarians fighting some... A green helicopter? You get more units, like, in the loot boxes that we found. But we only got experience. These guys appear to be getting helicopters, apparently. And if you lose your settler, you die. Hello, Mr. Chopper, sir? Oh, the chopper belongs to the barbarians now? 
Hey! Supply drop south. You're absolutely right. When you're right, you're right. Get me out of this freaking hellhole, dude. Oh! Um... Let's not, then? Yes, hello, Tomo. We can move and then attack. No, we can attack after moving. Slide... Oh, no! Okay. Hold on, dude. So, we can attack twice. But these guys are already a little weak. My personal opinion, toss me a quick little fortify. See what what they do. Big mistake. Then destroy. It. Then Destroy him. Excuse me, I can attack twice. <laughs> Apparently not. If movement permits. But what does that mean? Like, I was standing right next to them. I don't even have to move. Oh, it's because you're attacking into forest. Or hills, rather. Yo, it's the final circ, boys. <laughs> Stay focused. <laughs> Movement did not permit. Oh, apparently so. Hey, hey, don't don't do it. Dial in. We got a chance for lethal here. Erase him. Not erased. Where you going, dude? The circle's done. Oh, you are a fool. You are a fool. <laughs> Welcome to the squad. Now freaking run away <laughs> and fortif- Actually, just level up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Still in the circle. No. They just got promoted! Major victory. Body him yet again. Can I tell you, while we're resolving this combat here, um, so while I was at PAX, I had this incredible joke stuck in my head, and I forgot it when I came back to Canada. Um, please get out of their attack range. Oh, we got it. They have a rocket launcher now. The joke is very simple. It's the song, um... Space Oddity by uh, David Bowie. And it's just the whole song is normal until things get really bad. And uh, David Bowie goes, Tell my wife I love her very much. And then Mission Control just replies, No! Now that Major Tom is gone, I'll bed his wife. I'll raise his son. Can you hear me, Major Tom? And then, you know, and then the song just goes into the normal. And it just, the rest of the song is totally normal. It works more as, you know, it's like an anti-joke. Oh, my turn's almost over. Whatever, dude. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, you're done. Um, I don't know, dude. Let's just get weird with it. Let them fight. You're good. You guys, you stay frosty here. Just heal up. Just book it to the rocket. <laughs> I forgot about the rocket, honestly. Um. Why is there Thanos dust? Um, it's not Thanos dust. It's like a cyber volcano. Duh. Hey, we're in the circle. <laughs> hey! Uh, I don't know, man. Would I rather go through the water? Or through the city? Oh. Through, through the city. Something, something. Escape from the city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put the gun at the front. Um... You guys know you take damage there, huh? Body. It's very strange. That's where I'm at right now. Two attacks per turn if you have not moved. Does movement permit? Did the AI just go into the red zone? You know. Yo, that's a supply drop, dude. Sometimes you gotta go into the blue to heal. Didn't you watch that first PUBG major? Oh, it's ruthless. Movement permits. It's a drop! Let me get the drop, dude! You guys are in a lot of trouble. You promoted him. He can't move. Well, if that's not a thinly veiled metaphor for cor corporate culture, I don't know what is, brother. No, not you. 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 Go. You can't go. What, you didn't attack? You sat there doing nothing. You gotta unlink them first? That makes sense. Yo, what did we get? A functional tank? <laughs> the heck is that? Alright, alright, where's the circle going? It's not it's not moving yet. That's fine, that's fine. Um So Where's the... Where's this rocket ship, dude? No promotion. You just hear... The tank's gonna scout for us, okay? Oh, you do have a promotion. Or does the Civ have a promotion? That doesn't make any sense. did have okay. Alright, move, 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 move. Get promoted. You guys, you're in formation again, like that Beyonce song. Whoa, there we go. We found him. Although those are literally an anti-tank crew. So I don't know if I would recommend what we just did there, but that's okay. Don't do it. Don't shoot me with a rocket launcher. Okay. 
Minor victory. Could be worse. Major victory. Movement will not permit. But that's okay. Easy. Maybe the escape ship is on escape ship, sorry, is on the volcano. Um mutants. Whatever, dude. I'm not afraid. What are you doing? Just get out of here. I don't care about you, Raiders. You're cool in my book. I'm just trying to get to the freaking chopper, dude. I will say, like, you know, with authority, I'm probably the best player in the entire game. Like, lifetime. In history. By far. Next turn, please. Like, am I the best Civ 6 player? No. I, I do have a 100% win rate. Not like I'm bragging or anything, but... Um, but when it comes to the Battle Royale, I'm way up there. One of the best. You lost to Dan? Wasn't that in Civ 5? That was in Civ 6? Okay, my bad. It was Civ 6. We should do another multiplayer game of Civ 6. We need to find the time. There's a lot of other stuff on the list. But now I actually... You wouldn't know it from watching this, but I played a lot of Civ this year. Played the Switch version. Played the PC version. Garlic Civ. Civ Scampy. Coconut Fried Civ. That's about it. I got all of them. So, like, I'm in the circle, dude. But I'm a little worried that the rocket ship is on an island. And it's going to hurt me to get to that island. There's a rocket ship. People are like, what rocket ship are you talking about? There's a rocket ship, okay? That's probably the worst upgrade we could have taken there. There's a little escape pod somewhere. We just don't know where it is. No, there is not. Hey, listen. It might be my first game. But I read the tutorial, okay? The tutorial's just lore? It can't be, because I read it. The rockets are there if you believe. Oh, that's what happens when you win? Resin. Well, I'll tell you, these guys are not going to beat me. Basically, just stay healed forever. Oh, you are in... I'm just going to hold the choke point here. Never mind, I will blast you. Uh oh. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Thank God we gave this guy strength against other tanks.
Stay frosty in the city. You guys are doing great. Just keep it up. Where the heck did you come from? They're in for a world of hurt. You're going to retire with a 100% win rate? I think there's a realistic chance that could be what happens here. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Was that my civilians that took that shot? You want to play some PUBG after this? I think I would, actually. I think I would. Steppers. I can't take it seriously right now. I'm sorry. go first game easy win killed every other team in the game look at the graph number of combats we were in second units killed absurd units lost zero doesn't even show up on the graph for some reason. Um, they all laughed at us. They told us we were too weak and too few to make it to the lander. Well, who's laughing now? Who's the last faction off this stupid rotten planet? Who's got a one-way ticket to a shiny new spaceship? Okay. All right. Well, um, I do think that this actually could be more fun with real human beings. Um... But, I only want to play it with my friends. So, maybe we'll file that one away. To be played later? To, to at least give it a chance, you know what I mean? At some point in the future. But, I would definitely suggest that playing against AI is not a great idea. Did you guys see this tweet? If you don't have enough money for gaming equipment, for streaming or YouTube, do this. Sell your bed. Buy a $10 air mattress. Stop eating out. Only eat Chef Boyardee. Live like shit until you grow. Any, any advice that starts with sell your bed, you're really, you're starting on, a, on the back foot when it comes to convincing people. Who, you can sell a lot of things, but why? All right, don't don't spam it too much. It's gonna get me in a lot of trouble. But why sell your bed? That's just too far. Like you can sell, like your old consoles, or like you know mow some lawns or something like that. I feel bad. Because I'm, I'm pretty sure this is like a, like a 17-year-old Fortnite pro. Which is like, you know. I'm not punching down. I'm just saying like, I get it. You get big and you think you got like good advice for people. But like, sell your bed. That's insane. <laughs> it could be a joke. If it's a joke, I guess he got me. Because I was trolled and didn't laugh, which is the height of humor. 
Yeah, stop buying groceries. Just get your mom to bring food to your house, dumbass. Oh, hello, Austin. Hello. Sell your bed, idiot. I should. <laughs> Things a piece of shit. Buy a ten dollar air mattress. No, I'm gonna buy a eight hundred dollar real mattress. Dude, we're gonna get a real mattress soon too. And we have a real mattress. We're gonna get another one though. Yeah, I don't know what man. I, I I'm I haven't bought a mattress yet because I don't know. Like I, I like I want to go to a mattress store and like lay on the mattresses and be like, oh, this one seems good. But like, how do you know unless like they should have a store where they have mattresses and you just get to go to sleep there. Mm. And if you like the the night's sleep you get, then you get to buy the mattress. But you have to be watched so that you don't do anything. You know. Yeah, I don't care. If it's like store or employees, I don't give a shit. Okay. I think we're okay, gonna get you... a. I think we're gonna get a Casper. We slept on a Casper in Iceland, and it was uh, amazing. And then, I we were in IKEA like a couple weeks ago, and I took a sit down on the spring mattresses. I was like, this feels like it's a nightmare on the foam mattresses or whatever the heck is called. I was like, this is a dream come true. I'm all about the foam. Yeah, I want to get one of those Tempur-Pedic, but I don't know if I'd like it. And it's very expensive. Can I ask you a personal question? Uh, sure. What's your sleep number? <sighs> 69. Yeah, naturally. Um, What's your Pokemon Go number? Oh, do I, are you playing again? I just played it for the first time. Dude, catch Jirachi. Oh, I'm a long ways away from that. Dude, my camera is not going to be able to handle PUBG. What does that mean? I'm looking at it in the in the preview window, and I'm pretty sure the camera is like 4 FPS right now. What is wrong with your camera? What's wrong with PUBG, brother? No, works, no, no, no. It works no. There's fine. a lot wrong with PUBG. It works fine for your Isaac. Your camera is broken. It works fine for Isaac. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What what kind of camera do you have? You don't have the the Logitech, do you? It's a Logitech C922. What the fuck? It's not the camera's fault. It might be a driver issue. Although it's I gotta did, be. I did install a new driver um, to make it work, but yeah, like <sighs> shh, 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 shh. So, something's up. That should not be happening. It's just on like a PC the computer like is getting it's getting no. up there. And you know how my like, computer is half as good as yours, and my webcam didn't do that. Maybe you you're not putting as much information through the camera. You know how much do you move? <laughs> Can what? I get a squad invite? I've I've sent you a squad invitation. Look out of the. I can't speak for Dan because I feel like some days he's playing on a Nvidia three four potato, uh, but. I'm pretty sure both you and Melf have remarkably better PCs than I do. Uh, I, still got a, I still got a 970. Can, I don't want to talk too loud right yet. 